I chose to come to Dartmouth because of the community and the academics. I felt that I could pursue knowledge through classes or even through conversations. It's rare to find um, a supportive community like we have at Dartmouth. So um, it was really the people that drew me into the school. I came from a small high school uh, where I kind of at least knew everyone's name. I loved that. I loved how I can kind of walk around campus and make real relationships with people around me. Of all the colleges that I visited, none had a community to the level of Dartmouth. You can really have the opportunity to interact with your professors as equals and also to know that your peers are there to, to collaborate with you and not to compete with you. As a 17-year-old, 18-year-old, I had no idea what I wanted to study. And I loved the fact that Dartmouth really encouraged me to explore all of my options before I made a decision. That felt different than some of the other places I'd looked at. And it's definitely paid off because I wound up studying a lot of things I wasn't expecting to. One of the main reasons I chose to come to Dartmouth was because of the quirky traditions, such as running around the bonfire or wearing flair, which is my favorite, which is wearing a crazy costume or a vibrant tutu around campus just for fun. I initially chose Dartmouth because of its incredible focus on undergraduate education. After having sworn off applying to college in Canada entirely on the basis of it's too cold and I'll get depressed, I chose Dartmouth without even coming to visit because it was the most flexible STEM program, because it had the best study abroad, and because it transmitted me a sense of community that would help me feel at home far from my beloved Panama. I really wanted to get involved in the outdoors, which I've luckily been able to do. Um, even having like really very minimal experience before coming to Dartmouth, it's been super accessible. On my sophomore year of high school, I took my recruiting trip here with my older brother. Walking around campus, I just saw every single person wearing Dartmouth gear. You know, people were non-athletes, athletes, they just all had Dartmouth on. And that's just really cool to see the school pride. I'm a first-generation low-income student. Hearing about the Fisa community, which is dedicated towards helping low-income students and first-generation students, was really important for me because I really wanted to feel like I was supported by people who had similar identities to me and also by a faculty that cared about my issues maybe throughout the school year and were people that I could turn to. There's a lot of different opportunities and centers to learn more about the interests that you like and also just to grow as well as a leader and a person. 